Hi guys, here's a real cracking little uh, scale for you and, and really useful riff as well. The scale we're going to look at today is the pentatonic scale, uh, minor pentatonic. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to play, first of all, A minor pentatonic, then we're going to take it up to B flat, just so we get to learn it um, more easily. So uh, this is what the scale looks like. We go G, A is the root. D, slide up to E, G, A, back down, A, G, E, D, and slide down to C, A, which is the root, and G is the seventh. So that's three, five, three, five, seven, five, seven. And uh, also learn that up here. Starting on the A string. So that means that you're going to be playing 10, 12, 10, 12, slide up to 14, 12, 14. Up and down that. Uh, and now, just for fun and for your own good and practice, Take it up a semitone to B flat because this is a classic key uh, that a lot of funk and jazz is played in because of horns and the tuning of the horns. So there you should have four, six, four, six, eight, six, eight, and an octave higher. 1414 slide up on the fourth one four. I do that because I play double bass and I find that gets me the best tone and uh, most solid technique. Of course it is okay to use one three one three and obey the uh, the one fret per finger rule. Especially I think. Uh, as the frets get closer together. All right, so let's get on to the riff now. This is the riff. Okay, so I played a, I slapped the bass there in between just to give you the two and the four so you could hear where they lie. Um, let's look at the riff. Basically, I'm playing down the first three notes of the pentatonic scale. B flat, A flat, F. And then I'm going to skip the next two notes and go to the root. So after I hit the root, that I move to the D flat, the minor third. And then after that, I'm playing the seventh A flat, B flat, D. That's ah, D flat, B e flat, and then repeat. So you can see that it's 
it's very easy to transpose. Very easy to transpose that riff. To any key that you want it. The shape stays the same. The shape is the same. It's an easy shape to remember because it's done. Follows some kind of logical symmetry in a way. Uh, so have a lot of fun with that. That is tabbed out and is available at my website for download. Uh, you just need to follow the link and subscribe and you can get a lot of uh, tablature downloads and more at my website. You can also get some music downloads too um, in my uh, member subscriber area. Alright, thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you again for another really useful riffs lesson soon.